ABC4 News at 6 starts now. Good evening, I'm Emily Flores. And I'm Emily Clark filling in for Glenn Mills. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. Temperatures are dropping in Rocky Mountain Power and UDOT are preparing now to keep you safe ahead of the storm. Haley Hendricks has our early winter reminders. I'm standing on an 800 ton salt pile and some of it will be on Utah roads tomorrow morning. Check out what you need to know in preparation for the upcoming storm. UDOT says loading up this salt is one way to be prepared early enough for crews so that Tuesday morning they can get out on the roads in time for the commute. However, they say you need to prepare to drive in the upcoming weather conditions. As we transition from the, the summer and the uh, fall season into uh, winter, you want to make sure that your vehicles are ready to go. That means that you have your tires properly inflated, that you have proper tread, that your windshield wipers are, are ready to go as well. While UDOT is preparing to keep you safe on the road, Rocky Mountain Power has equipment ready to go and extra crews in place. But Rocky Mountain says it's still important to have an emergency plan in place. There's a number of things that you can do, but one, if you're on medical or life-saving uh, medical equipment, make sure that you have a backup plan for that. Also, make sure that you have power banks and maybe backup batteries for your cell phones because communication is key during outages. You know, when your power's out, the one thing you want to know is, you know, what's caused it? When is it going to come back on? With around 900,000 customers in Utah, Rocky Mountain says if your power does go out, you can get updates by texting 759-677. Reporting in Salt Lake City, Haley Hendricks, ABC4 News. All right, thank you, Haley. And on that, we'll turn for a quick check of the forecast. Dan Post.